Hello everyone, this is Deepa. Welcome to Deep's Kitchen. And I'm really happy to share with you all that hereafter you will be getting kids recipes from Deep's Kitchen which are very healthy, delicious and colorful, easy to make at home. So to begin with today in kids recipes I'm going to share with you homemade popsicle using fresh fruits like strawberry and mango. So make sure you all get subscribed to my channel to get up to date on kids recipes. So here are the ingredients you need for this. So to begin with, here I have uh, 10 strawberries and uh, one big size mango which are fresh and they are ripe well and uh, sweetened condensed milk. So, First, I'm going to remove the stem from the strawberries. And then chop them into small pieces. Add it to your blender and blend it into a smooth puree. So our strawberry puree is ready and make sure you are not adding any water while blending. And now I am just going to work on my mango to make it into a puree. So cut them and then you are going to cut your mango uh, in a crisscross way to easily take out the pulp. And then add the pulp into your blender and blend it into a smooth puree. So don't add any water because adding water reduces the flavor and your popsicle will not taste good. So my mango puree is ready. So our strawberry and mango puree is ready which are very smooth and creamy. And uh, as I mentioned earlier make sure you are not adding any water while blending them. And now I am going to add uh, 2 tablespoons of uh, sweetened condensed milk to each puree. So 2 tablespoons in mango puree and 2 tablespoons in strawberry puree. This helps to give a nice flavor to your popsicle and also nice texture. Just mix it up well. So here I have my popsicle mold ready. So you could either pour your mango puree first or a strawberry puree first whichever you want it on the top. So I am just going to add the strawberry puree first. So fill only half of your popsicle mold and remaining half we are going to fill it up with mango puree so I'm just adding the remaining half with mango puree now and then cover them up with a lid and they are ready to go into your freezer for at least 8 hours So you can see how nice the color looks. So now my baby wants the blue color to be here. So let it be here. So I'm just going to freeze it for 8 hours and then show you guys how they look. After 8 hours of freezing now I just kept my popsicle mold inside a bowl of water. This helps to take out your popsicle easily. So don't keep them for a long time. Just 15 to 20 seconds is enough. Otherwise it will melt and your popsicle will become puree again. 
so now I'm just going to take out the popsicle to show you guys how they look wow see how nice it is so friends this is how you can make a homemade popsicle using fresh fruits at home you could also use any fruits of your choice which you love and uh, hope you guys find this video helpful if so don't forget to give me a thumbs up by hitting the like button and stay tuned to my channel for a lot more delicious and healthy kids recipes by hitting the subscribe button and you may also follow me on facebook and google plus to get up to date on deep's kitchen recipes thank you so much for watching my video see you guys soon till then spice up your taste buds with the deep's kitchen recipes bye bye